Hey guys, how's it going? It is Jared HD here and welcome to episode number 22 of season 3. This is the finale for season 3 of the Everton Career Mode series. Uh, quickly before we start the video, if I sound like I've got a bit of a weird voice, uh, it is because I still have a chest infection which is quite annoying. But uh, yeah, my voice is kind of screwed up from that. But the opening match of the episode is an away match against Aston Villa at Ivy Lane. And right now, uh, Fellaini is on the ball. He passed it to Jelovic. He plays it through to Lukaku. Lukaku belts it at Shea Given, I think it is, or De Guzman. And it goes past him into the back of the net to give us a 1-0 lead in the fifth minute. Uh, great start of the match. But now Kyle Walker is on the ball. He just gets the cross in. Then Clayton goes to the head. It goes out to Jelovic. Back to Lukaku. And then it goes out to Wellington Nem. Lukaku tackles him. He goes near post finish. And we are up two goals, two nil. What a great finish there from Lukaku. And what a great start of the game he has had. And now Jelovic passed it to Lukaku yet again in the 30th minute. Uh, he's going to cut back, find some space, pass it to Poli. Poli unleashes the shot. And what a goal there from Poli to give us a 3 nil lead in the 31st minute. This is an absolute demolition job against Aston Villa. We always seem to smash them. Uh, if there's two things I've noticed in this series, we always smash Aston Villa and we always lose to Manchester United. But right now, Seamus Coleman is in the ball. He plays it through to Romelu Lukaku, who chops back inside. And what a finish there from Lukaku on the left foot to give us a 4-0 lead in the 69th minute. An absolute amazing finish there from Lukaku. And right now, Johnson, he's going to play it through to Barry Bannan in the 88th minute. Uh... Uh, I think it's Pepe Reina is trying to get the ball up and then Banan takes it straight outside the box he cuts back inside, crosses it to Darren Bent and what a goal there for Darren Bent in the 90th minute, it is a consolation goal though, as we defeat Aston Villa 4-1 to give us 3 points in our hunt for the Premier League campaign and the second match of this episode is a Premier League match at Goodison Park against Southampton and guys, if we win this episode, if we win this match we officially win the Premier League title. And Ibrahimovic is unable to give us an early lead there, but now Noble crosses it in to Peltier. Peltier goes to the headache, goes out to Corker, and Corker just belts it above the post. And right now, Merkel is played through here in the 12th minute. First time's in what a save there from the Southampton keeper. It goes out to Miniham, who crosses it in. Valios with a bicycle, but a good save there from Andrew Joir. And right now, uh, Davis is on the ball for Southampton in the 26th minute. He crosses it in. Uh, it goes to Adam Lalana. He passes it to D. Ridder, who crosses it into Lee. Lee gets it on the volley, but a good save there from Thompson. And now Shaw, Luke Shaw, is on the ball. He crosses it into Lee. And oh, it hits the post there, and Thompson is able to recollect the ball. And we head into the sheds at halftime with a nil all scoreline. Hopefully, we can get a goal early on. And now Davis crossed it in. A good punch away there from Thompson. Now Merkel plays it over the top to Apostolos Velios, who is going to just, uh, he's going to kind of get instruction there. But uh, he cuts back inside, goes through the gap, takes the shot, and he gives us a 1 0 lead here in the 71st minute. Uh, we are so close to winning this Premier League title now, guys. Uh, what a great goal there from Velios. And now Francisco Jr. is on the ball uh, in the 80, 82nd minute. Crossed in and Miniham goes out to Velios. Velios belts it and just to the right of the post. And the match finishes, guys. We are the Premier League champions. Everton FC 2015 Premier League champions, I believe it is, or 2016. We did it, guys. In my third season as manager, we have finally won the Premier League title. This is a crazy achievement. Uh, we are, we still have the FA Cup final to go, and if we would have won the Champions League, uh, that would have just been a crazy season. But we are, did get eliminated in the semi-finals. But there it is, guys. You guys really want to see this in real life if you are an Everton supporter. And I have done it. We have won the Premier League title with a second string side. Uh, but yes, there it is. That is just a beautiful sight. And hopefully next season we can make it two in a row. But we ha now have to uh, reclaim our composure and get ready for the FA Cup final at Wembley against Queen's Park Rangers. 
Right now, Jarvis is on the ball. He passes it to Lukaku. Lukaku cracks back inside. What a shot! And oh, he hits the post. Oh, and now Walker unleashes the shot. And we hit the post again. But then Lukaku gets the rebound and gives us a 1 0 lead here in the 23rd minute over QPR. What a great start to our FA Cup campaign, our final campaign. Now Lukaku plays it through, lob through ball there to Matthew Jarvis, who passes it to Ibrahimovic. Ibrahimovic hits the post. That is the third time this match we have hit the post. But we head into the sheds at Wembley at half time with a 1-0 lead over QPR in this FA Cup final. And right now Park plays it through to Bruno Andrade. He's trying to outpass, uh, outpace Kyle Walker in our defense. We match up. He roulettes. He takes a shot. And what a goal there from Bruno Andrade to bring it back to a one all scoreline. Very tense moments. Uh, and right now, it is Jisung Park on the ball. He's going to play a lob through ball there to Elkerson, the striker, against Jones. Jones falls down. He passes it across goal, but he just misses. And uh, right now, it is Fallen on the ball. He plays it through to Elkerson again. Elkerson against Hummels. Hummels makes the tackle. It goes back out to Fallen. Fallen gets it past to Elkerson. Elkerson takes it near post. And he scores a goal to give QPR a 2-1 lead in the 88th minute. Oh, my God, guys. How have we managed to go down two minutes to go? We really need to get a goal back. Uh, that was just a nice knee point finish. But now, off the kickoff, we are on the ball. It is uh, Ibrahimovic on the ball. He's just running straight through them. Uh, he's going to pass it out to Leighton Baines on the wing. Can our captain Leighton Baines uh, throw it across? He's going to pass it back to Jarvis. Jarvis trying to find some space. Pass it to Lukaku. Lukaku unleashing a shot. And what a save there from Julio Cesar. And now off the corner. It is going to go to Lukaku. He's going to take the cross. No, he's not. It's going to be late and Baines to take the cross. 90th minute, last chance. Hummels flies. Hummels gets the header in the 90th minute. That is almost identical to his header that he got against Chelsea in the semi-final of the FA Cup. Another 90th minute header there from Matt Hummels to make it a 2 all scoreline in this FA Cup final. What a great header there from Matt Hummels. We are so happy. It's going to go to extra time now. But where is it? We have one last attack. One last attack. Noble is on the ball. Noble, he's trying to break through. We we lose the ball. Traore, pass it back to Green. Green goes out to Lukaku. Lukaku wins the header. Noble is on the ball. Noble, Noble. Oh, he gets tackled and it's going out for a throw-in. Come on, guys. Any second now, the referee is going to blow the full-time whistle. This is to win the FA Cup. Leighton Baines, throw into to Nikita Jelovic. Jelovic trying to make some space. Pass it to Lukaku. Lukaku gets the goal. We win the FA Cup in the 90th minute. Oh, my God. Oh, my voice is gone now, but we have gone from 2-1 in the 88th minute to get two late 90th minute goals, and we have won the FA Cup. Lukaku, you fucking beast. You are a tank, mate. Oh, my God, I am never letting Lukaku go. The day I let Lukaku go will be the day I fail as a YouTuber. And, oh, my God, how did that happen? Uh, we just need the ref to blow the full-time whistle now. Hoyle is on the ball. And the referee calls full time. We have won the FA Cup. Oh, what an episode. What a season, guys. We have managed to win the Premier League title. And we have now won the FA Cup. This is an absolute brilliant season. Uh, this is just crazy. I cannot believe it that we were down 2-1 in the 88th minute. And we ended up winning it 3-2 in the 90th minute. That is just crazy. And now we lift up the FA Cup trophy at Wembley Stadium. Oh my god, this is the season of a lifetime. We are not going to experience this ever again. This is just crazy. I cannot believe this. Uh, if I don't get manager of the season, I don't know what I have to do. <laughs> uh, if we would have won that Champions League, that would have been beautiful. But I'm just going to sit in the rest of the season in the Premier League because we've already run it, so there's not much to play for. And we come up against West Ham here at Upton Park. We're going to sim it. And we end up losing 3-1. McMacalaney does get our goal. I was playing a second tier side because I don't want to risk any injuries. Uh, Marseille did win the Europa League, which is a bit of a surprise. They beat Juventus. And now the final Premier League game of the season is at home against Chelsea. Uh, a side that was really in contention for the trophy most of the season, or well, the Premier League trophy, that is. 
And we are going to sim this match right about now. Or are we? Yes, and we win 2-1 with uh, Ibrahimovic getting a double there. And this is the end of season squad report. What a crazy season. So many of our players have grown so much. Lukaku is an 83 overall player now. That is just crazy. When we picked him up, he was a 77 player. That is just crazy, guys. Barcelona did win the Champions Cup, which is good because uh, they did eliminate us. So we have been eliminated by the side who ended up winning and I have see I have won manager of the season in the Premier League because of my excellent performances at Everton this is crazy uh, the board is extremely happy with how I performed this season and how the club performed uh, just a crazy season an amazing season uh, but there's gonna be so much pressure on us next year to win uh, everything that is uh, able to win like the Champions Cup that is my next goal guys I've already won the Premier League and everything I just really want to win the Champions Champions Cup next season, but it has been Jared HD here with the end of Season 3 of the Everton Career Mode Series. I really hope you guys are enjoying this uh, this whole series. I, I love doing this series, guys, and I'm going to have Episode 1 of Season 4 out in two days from now, so get pumped for that, guys. If you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like. Have an awesome day, guys, and I'll speak to you tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.